Now, as many of you might know by now that NIO yesterday, they reported record-breaking deliveries which made a lot of the new investors to be excited because we've been waiting for the 20,000 or over 20,000 deliveries from NIO for quite some time. And seeing it happening yesterday made a lot of retail investors to be excited. Now, as I said yesterday, uh, not only were we the ones that were very excited by the figures we saw coming out from NIO in terms of the July deliveries, but even institutional investors are showing their excitement about the numbers we received from NIO yesterday because, ladies and gents, uh, uh, today when I woke up, I received two, of course, uh, analysts or big financial institutions coming out and really showing that they like the kind of deliveries they saw coming from NIO yesterday. I mean, both Deutsche Bank and Morgan Stanley came out and showed their excitement by giving us what they think about yesterday's deliveries. Now, before I dig deep onto what those financial institutions said, you already know that this video is just an entertainment video and not a professional financial advice video. And I would appreciate if you can just hit that like button if you are to enjoy the content that I'll be giving you about the report or the news that came from both Deutsche Bank and Morgan Stanley after they saw the over 20,000 deliveries which NIO delivered yesterday so uh, if you enjoy this content hit that like button as it also takes some time for me to compile and i'll also appreciate otherwise if you're not subscribed consider hitting that subscribe button and hit that notification bell because on this channel new is a stock that i talk a lot about almost on a day to day now before wasting any more of your time deutsche bank uh, came out and said that they were really excited about the new deliveries and they believe that still in the Q3, meaning that still in the next coming two months, NIO will still see a massive growth in terms of the deliveries, which is something that shows or that should definitely motivate you and me as retail investors because ladies and gents, not only are we the ones seeing, of course, the growth that is coming to NIO, but also even the big financial institutions now are also seeing uh, what NIO can be able to do after we saw of course yesterday's deliveries i mean with deutsche bank at least i know they've always been positive on to neo's deliveries and they've been also saying that of course neo will see some huge recovery in deliveries in the second half of this year and that of course made them to reaffirm that of course the rest of q3 in fact the second half we will see neo continue delivering good delivery numbers now with morgan stanley it was a different story because you will know that morgan stanley mid-July, they came out and said that they foresee NEO delivering 15,000 deliveries for the month, which to get to see NEO delivering over 20,000, uh, it made them to be so excited because NEO just thrashed their, of course, the prediction on the July deliveries and, they, and delivered over 20,000 deliveries, which is something that is incredible. Now, uh, with Morgan Stanley, the good thing about the report or the good thing about, of course, their sentiment after the yesterday's, uh, of course, deliveries from NIO, they are saying, ladies and gents, they are foreseeing NIO stock or the NIO stock to continue surging uh, within the next 15 days. The surging or the rising or the rally of NIO, they are expecting it to continue because they believe that these deliveries are the ones that will make the share price of NIO to continue surging of which to get it being reaffirmed by them also it made uh, some of the investors to be really excited so personally as i've said i was also excited and i would like to see of course neo continuing growing in terms of deliveries i mean personally as per my yesterday's video i believe that august september we are, we might see chances are very high that we might see neo starting to deliver over 25000 vehicles which will be so amazing to see the kind of deliveries that neo will produce for the rest of the year so i'm very excited or i was very excited about yesterday's earnings and to get to see that morgan stanley deutsche bank are also really excited and up optimistic about what is ahead makes me to be really excited as a new investor because it is no longer us or it's not us retail investors alone who see the the massive potential ahead onto the new stock but also the big financial institutions they can see the potential that lies ahead for neo so i'm very excited about the fact that these two analysts or these two big financial institutions remain bullish and they were really excited about the deliveries they saw of course uh, coming out of neo otherwise with all that guys i just thought i'd just give you this quick update if you enjoyed this video don't forget to hit the like button comment and subscribe and once you subscribe don't forget to hit or click that notification bell so that at least you get notified by youtube every time i drop a new content otherwise you will know that right now sometime now in august 
Neo will be launching their eighth model, which of course is the EC6, and that once again will definitely drive in the demand into the Neo stock because that is a, a, a coupe SUV, which is of course a younger brother to the EC7, and it looks like it will also have the tailgate at the back, which is something that will make it to sell, of course, uh, pretty fast, probably uh, even much better than the, its elder brother, the EC7, which will, of course, continue bringing in more deliveries onto the new stock. Otherwise, that's all from me. And before you buy new, do your own due diligence so that at least you can be comfortable as you are investing in the stock market. Otherwise, that's all from me. And I wish you nothing but the best in your stock market investing journey. And God bless you all.